Oh, my God, Chelsea lost again. Why should Chelsea cry like that at the hands of Graham Potter? What did we do wrong? Why should the entire Chelsea lovers pass through the pain of losing because of Graham Potter? He is the most terrible manager Chelsea has ever got and I have no idea why he is not sacked for a long time. Oh, we have totally missed Roman Abramovich. If Abramovich was yet the holder of Chelsea, Graham Potter would not be authorised as Chelsea's manager in the first place. What kind of gibberish is this? I have no idea where Potter learned his coaching. Potter must simply be fired now before he breaks Chelsea entirely. Sack Potter instantly before it's over. He is a great obstacle for Chelsea. I have never seen a decoy manager like Potter. Sack Potter now and bring Chelsea a better manager. Chelsea suffered a 1-0 loss at the hands of Borussia Dortmund in Germany. Despite the result, many Chelsea fans across the globe will be feeling confident for the return leg with the Blues having 21 shots this evening including one miraculously cleared off the line by former Liverpool midfielder Emre Can. Here are three things I learned from tonight's performance. 1. Graham Potter's decision to leave out Aubameyang could cost us. For me, it was the wrong decision in the first place to leave out your only natural striker from the Champions League squad. As tonight showed, Chelsea had some lovely bits of football until the moment to finish, even if the team plays better without Aubameyang, you can't possibly tell me he wouldn't have scored one of those chances that Joao Felix missed tonight. 2. Ben Chilwell is Chelsea's starting left back. Chilwell looked shaky in some moments defensively, but for me he was a bigger improvement than Mark Kukurala, especially going forward. Chilwell was constantly offering the attacking support to Mudrick that he lacked against West Ham. Despite Mudrick playing poorly, it was not down to Ben Chilwell. Chilwell created a total of three chances this match. Astonishingly, that's more than Kukurala has created in his last eight games in all competitions. Getting Ben healthy and up to speed is vital if Chelsea wants to still have a shot at the top four and turn the second leg around at home. 3. Anthony Barry might have to have a position review. You saw our goal tonight, why on earth did we have one man back? Why Enzo? It was a mismatch between him and Adeyemi on pace. Anthony Barry is known to be responsible for Chelsea's set-piece organisation so it baffles me how we've had the same tactic from corners for the last two to three seasons. Chelsea needs to seriously look into Barry if he does not mix things up. For me, you can only get away with one man back from corners if it's Nagolo Kante. My opinion. I think Potter did not finish his coaching course so he should go back and continue learning. Or he should go back to the small clubs which is where he belongs, to master his coaching lessons. Chelsea is a well-established club. Sack Potter instantly. Go away, Potter. Please, subscribe for more sweet Chelsea news and rumours.